What's up? Welcome back to the channel, guys. Um, I bought some ambient um, acrylic interior lights for my car. I'm going to show you how they look, and um, if you want to pick them up, I'm going to put the link in the description. So these lights are going to be inside the interior. Um, I was going to get them done by some guy. He had a like a sale going on, so I was going to do it with him. So I asked the guy if he was going to use a fiber optic um, lights, and he said no, that he was going to use acrylic lights, the ambient acrylic lights, that he said that they're they're better because uh, they the light goes through the whole light or the lighting goes through the whole thing, the fiber octave, you know, I have like a little projector and it throws the light through the little plastic. So he said these were better. So I started just um, researching them, looking for them and I found some. So I'm gonna show you the ones that I bought. Okay, on this video, I'm just gonna show you how the product looks and uh, I'm gonna connect it so you can see the functions that it has. All right, this is all the stuff right here. This one is a 18, 18 piece. So this is all the stuff that it comes with. It comes with a, this is a switch. This is a, the, it says right there everything. Just take a look at that, pause it if you want. So it also comes with instructions. And then the app code right here. So it seems like everything's already all connected for you, so you can know how to route it and stuff. So look at look at this light. It, it looks like if it has that the little light through the inside, it's all black all around. So not like the other ones that are clear. This is all black, and this is also cuttable. You could just cut it to whatever size you want, which is good. Okay, this is what we got here. We got this one right here. This is the main one. This is gonna be for the, the dashboard. So we got the corner piece for the side, the remote, the module box, and then this is the long one for the front passenger's um, dashboard. And then that one, this one also has for the foot, where your feet go, the front and the rear. So it has four. And then over here, we got the other four. The other four doors, one, two, three, four doors for the, the, the panels. And then we have, this one's gonna be for the storage box on the door. And this one's gonna be for the door handle on the door. And each each one has its own box. And as you can see, each one has its own wiring where you have to connect it. So each one has its own box, but it's gonna be controlled by one, one only. So I don't have to get their own power. So this is what it comes with. So I guess on this one, I won't be able to do the, the center console. I want to be able to do the dashboard and the doors and that's it. And the foot rests, the foot rests and uh, the door handles and the storage box. So that's what it comes with. All right, so here I already connected it to power just to give it a demonstration. And this video is only going to be the function of the lights and stuff like that. It's not going to be the installation video. So I already connected to the power of the battery. Uh, it looks like they're working. It's going through like all kinds of different colors. So these are going to be the foot rest and this is going to be the dashboard one. There's another little piece around there somewhere. Where is it? This is the one on the other side of the steering wheel. All right. Okay. So then you got the, the remote over here. The remote it's kind of small but it's supposed to change the functions so you're supposed to press the middle and it turns off but the foot so you, it, it turns off the, the when you turn it off it turns off everything but it doesn't turn off the ones from the footrest see and then you, you move it to the side and So it has different functions. I think that's a color chasing one. What is this? Can't really see right now. 
But I think, yeah, that one's changing the, it's color chasing, which is cool. Okay. So that's that. I'm going to connect all of them together to see if, if it, see that's, it's color chasing. I'm going to connect them all together to see if, if, if the remote does control every single thing. Okay, let me connect them all. Okay, so I connected them all just for demonstration purposes. So they're all on right there. They're all the same color, they're yellow. And these are gonna be all the, this is gonna be like I told you, this one's gonna be for the handle. And the one that has this thing is gonna be the one for the, the storage box on the door. So what I'm starting to figure out is how do I change the color from this? Cause this is the footrest. So right now, as you can see, they're all the same color, right? So with this remote, you have to look at the remote. It'll tell you like the instructions, which how to do it, but I'm just gonna play with it right now. So, changes the colors. I think it's like 64 colors, or I don't know how many exactly. So you got all these colors. You could go solid or you could go also blinking or all kinds of different ones. The color chasing one is also here. So you can see right there, see? So even though they all have different boxes, they have, there's four different boxes, right? Or five. There's four, four for the door and then the main one. They all link together. So right here, I just have all, the, all of them connected, right? So there you go, it's pretty sick. I actually like this one. Because when it's off, you can't really, you can't see. Let me turn them off. You can't see them. Because it's just like a little, little strip that you're gonna be able to see when I install it. Then you just turn it around. You could also, you could control it from here. Or you could control it with the app. You press it in the middle, and then it turns on. and then these are the ones for the doors so that's what that's what i bought that's going to be the next thing i do to my car so um it's cool it has a, so the four doors and the dashboard and then it has the storage boxes and the door handles i think that's all i need and the foot where it rests this one's the foot ones so i'm going to do a separate video on the installation i'm also going to do a playlist that's gonna be like a playlist for the like um, all the videos that I watched to give me the ideas of how to do stuff. So it's gonna be uh, it's gonna say videos I used for installs. Check out that playlist. I'm gonna that's something new that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just put all the videos that I watched to learn how to do like take out door panels, take out the dashboard. And stuff like that because i might not be showing that on my video no more because it takes too long to record every single thing sometimes i want to get stuff done and um i don't have the time to be recording so if i skip through some things there's going to be a video right there on the playlist just check that out it's going to show you exactly how to take off the part or whatever so that way you guys can do your own research also but um i like this and um, i'm going to put the link in the description on on the on this video and if you guys want to purchase it. Oh, I'm going to show you right now. Hold on. I'm going to show you the, the app. Well, I'm not going to show you the app, but all you have to do is download the, this thing and you get the app, right? <clears throat> but I was going to show you the cool thing about this is that every single one has its own power source, right? So you don't have to run wires through the doors or nothing. Everything's going to be connected. I'll show you how right now. So everything's going to be connected with the, the switch. The switch panel from each door is gonna, you're gonna get the power from there which is cool so you don't have to run the wires through the the door grommets or anything like that and connect it all to one place each power source is going to come from the connector from each door um handle where you lower the window and higher the window you're going to get the power from there that's what it shows i'm still gonna have to figure that out but um 
I'll show you that in the, when I do my installation video. Uh, looks pretty easy. It says right there, just black with red, 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 black. So there's always power to the door, the window switches. So that's where you're going to get the power from. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one. All right, stay tuned to the next video for the installation. Here's just a little sneak peek of what I did. Let me show you a few of oh, some functions that it has. The lights down there. I haven't installed it properly yet. So I just did the dashboard for now. Let me show you the functions. So there's so many colors you could do. You could change the color of the chasing and everything. Fast, slow, whatever. But it looks pretty good easy to install so stay tuned to my next video probably um a week or so i'll show you how to how i did it